This episode's pick of the week is YSL Myself. It is one of my newest additions to my collection. Um, I personally was looking for another YSL because they they really impressed me when they um, released the Y a few years ago. I think it was like 2016, 2017. Anyway, it was immediately one of my favorites, but I had to discontinue it because too many people wear it. It's too popular for me. I don't like going places where people smell like me. I don't want to smell like the next man at all. So if I can't find a fragrance that I can mix with something else, I definitely find one that not too many people are on. But after y'all watch this episode, you're going to know about it. So I'm revealing a few of my secrets again on these episodes. And this is one of them. It's the newest addition to YSL. It's called Myself. And... I don't know why they call it myself. I guess I should keep it to myself, but it's one of those fragrances where you can really wear it anytime, anywhere. It's a very light, clean scent. Um, again, it's maybe a mixture for the Y. I'm not sure you probably can develop a concoction with the Y, but again, it's one of my favorite scents. It's, it's not overwhelming at all and it, it lasts for a very long time and I'm one of the people who when I buy fragrances I'm shopping for longevity just as much as I am for the scent and this one lasts for a minimum of six seven hours um I find myself smelling myself more throughout the day and I like that I like that reassurance from a fragrance let me know that hey I'm still here I'm still putting out um it's one of those fragrances where I would I would wear Again, it's an anytime fragrance. It's, it's like during the day, um, stepping out for the evenings, you know, going on a date, first date, or if you're a couple, just anytime, wearing it to an interview, wearing it to work, uh, me as a comedian, wearing it to a show. Uh, this is definitely a attention grabber. This is definitely one for someone who wants to be discovered. Um, it's, it's one of those ones where you don't even have to do too much. You don't even have to add another fragrance. You don't have to make a concoction if you want to. It's, it's just one of those that's really, it's a really, really good fragrance. And on a scale of one to 10, I would have to give it an eight and a half. If you love YSL Y, if you love YSL Tuxedo or YSL Trench, this would definitely be one to add to your collection. It is not as pricey as the YSL Trench or the YSL Tuxedo. You wouldn't have to hit big on your prize pick to go and buy those, but you don't have to hit as big to go and buy this myself because it's only $96 for this bottle. You can go and get it from Sephora or anywhere they sell fine fragrances. And they got two other bottles for people who hit big on their prize pick. They got a medium sized bottle for $125 and they got the biggest bottle for $125. 55. So again, if you hit big on your prize pick, you can go and grab that big bottle. But for people like me who ain't quite hitting yet, $96, Sephora, uh, Macy's, Neiman, Saks, wherever you can find fine fragrances at, YSL, myself, go and grab it. And it's definitely a Justin Whitehead approved. Welcome to the My Cinnamon Show. I am your host, Justin Whitehead. This show is only for people who wash their ass. So if that is not you, please log out and find something else to look at. In today's episode, we got my first guest, Nav Green. My brother, what's up? Yes, sir. And we are going to be talking about different types of scents that Nav like, different types of scents that Nav don't like, different types of places Nav will wear this scent, and what made Nav want to purchase this scent he bought in today. What you got for us today, bro? Uh, <coughs> He gonna put it out of his pocket. Like, yeah, <laughs> just oh totally. Sometimes, bro. Sometimes I feel like I don't. I don't smell it no more. I just sneak a little spray in. See, that's why you gotta. Them. You gotta do what I do, bro. When you what go, you when you when you go, you gotta tell them. Let me get a couple samples of this. You know, let me yeah. let me make. So sure. you ain't gotta tote around a so big. So you ain't bottle. gotta tote and, and cut that country. No, it ain't country. <laughs> You don't want to fuck around and end up somewhere and, and lose your bottle or, man, or break boy, your bottle. You crazy as hell you think I'm leaving my bottle. Well, I'm going to tell you what happened to me once. What? When I first started making some money, I wanted to show off what cologne I wear. Forgot the bottle was too big for TSA. Oh, boy. $600 bottle, bro. Please, please be, bro. Please be, bro. I swear to God, ain't nothing. Oh, no. Nah, fuck that. I missed my flight. <laughs> The bottle was more than the ticket. The, the fly, shit. I'm, I'm like, okay, well, I tell you what, um, I'm gonna take this back and I'm gonna go and get me another flight. Well, like, he, right. he was hoping you left that. He was hoping I left it because oh, they, they got a little stand over there. I saw some more shit over there. Oh, I was like, yeah. but you won't get mine. This shit was gonna be like this right here. Man. You gonna have it set up. Bro, no way. But nah, that, that do make sense. You though. know how I am about my cologne. 
And That's that was a that was a ball to Baccarat when it first came out. I had the big ball. That oh, was yeah. first. That was when I first got hip to it. But we ain't gonna talk about Baccarat today. We're gonna talk about the Nishio. What you got in here? What's what's the one? Paragon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, Paragon. It's the white ball too. So that's one of those elite. Yeah. So and then you know like. With it, like, you know, a lot of people, I be trying to get on sense that, like, people not really own. Right, Cause right, Because, like, right. you don't want to be walking around smelling like everybody. And, 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 and boy, in the city, they'll baccarat you to death. Oh, they, they go, they baccarat you to death. They, uh, savage you to death. Man, uh, why is that a why bun? Number, and, and they got so many buns, but it's like everybody go and grab the same one. Like, oh, yeah. they go to Creed, everybody grab the same one. It's like they don't have, a thousand other bottles from you to, for you to pick from, and that's why I created this show so I can teach all of you who just go and get the same bottle. That is different options out there. Yeah. We got a few options in here today, but we only gonna focus on one, and that's the one that Nail brought in for us today. And this actually happens to be one of the ones that I almost got, but I chose another one from the same line, and we'll get to that a little later on. But I want to ask Nail what. Made you pick this one. This, this is what you wearing today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, a female, bro. Oh, okay. So look, that'll do it. Every damn time, that'll do it. When you go, when you go in there to buy cologne, fragrances, or whatnot, like I feel like with men telling you, like even though you, you know, you be telling me about, like you know, what I mean, cologne and whatnot. Yeah, I tell you, but, you know, I yeah. tell everybody. But then when you in there and a female, be like, I'm like, which one you think better? And she, she sold it to me. She was like, oh, this the one. Yeah, because that's what we wear for anything. Yeah, I don't care. You know what I'm saying? I don't that's who no we walking up to me talking, when you smell good, man, get the hell out of my yeah. face. Okay, appreciate it. Yeah, man, the yeah it, it's only so many appreciate it, bro, that you want to hear. Right, 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 right. Female be like, what you got on? Yeah, that one they'd be like, yeah. but nah, so when I um and plus I didn't even know about the initio. So it's like response though. I don't mean to get you out there. So when the when the lady asks you what you got on, do you tell them? Oh no. Nah. Yeah. She's like, what you got on? I just bathe. Yeah. You know just joke with them and you're like, stop playing. Cause you That's just a know, conversation yeah, starter. Yeah, you know why they want it anyway. Yeah. Let another nigga smack it. Right. Them. Yeah, yeah. Man, I'm turning around and gave your shit to my baby dad. Now, if it's a stud, I might tell him. <laughs> Cause I, you know, I'm not finna try to, cause normally when a woman asks me what I got on, you know, I'm like, why? Wow, so your boyfriend can smell like me? That's either so she can say yes or I ain't got no boyfriend. But if yeah. it's a stud. So that's a conversation stud. Yeah, star. I know the stud ain't got no boyfriend. You never and know. And I know I don't want to fuck the stud. So, shit, here, here you, you go. You never know. They be double dipping. <laughs> <laughs> so you said a female made you pick that one. Yeah, so, but she worked there, though. Okay. Yeah, so she, she worked there. So then she was just telling me, and I never. So she sprayed a couple, and I was like, that shit smell good. Oh, yes. Because I really was, um, what's that, uh, the Clyde. Clive Christian. Yeah. Yes. So I make some great fragrances. Yeah. By the way. I like that, but that's you know it's you can't just wear that every day. No, it's not every day. Yeah. This so, is not really. It's every not really. Day, every, but but I wear it, I wear it when I want to. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> more affordable than Clive Christian. Yeah, yeah. but Clive, that Clive Christian, you got to be going somewhere. So my thing is, when you put this on, where are you going? Like, what what type of places are you going? Oh. Uh, I might be around a few people that I, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no, like, I'm running out of the house going to grab something and I'm going back. Nah, you know, I ain't putting that on. But, like, if I'm going to a setting where, like, you know, I might go, be going to eat some. You know what I mean? Or or I might be going walking around, you know what I mean, you know, shopping yeah, for yeah. the house stuff. Yeah, like, you're you know definitely going somewhere you want to be noticed because this is a, a fragrance where this, uh, when you wear this, you, you want to be, uh, you want to take the attention. This Bruh. is one not somebody who wanna who wanna be discovered. You you want this to own the room when you walk in. This you don't want somebody to come up on you and be like, hey, what you got on? This I'm gonna tell you, man is the attention. This just, but this why though, bro, with so many people spraying and putting their cologne on, you don't wanna not be smelled neither. Oh, you right. Yeah, you're so right. it like you're right, you're right. You and could so be that, in passing, you could be in Walmart. You hear somebody else be like, oh, you smell good to somebody else. You be like, man, I should have had my shit on, right. man. And, you know, and, and, and they probably got on some bullshit. Got on some bullshit. And a lot of people do that. They, You know, like you said, a lot of people touch up when they get to where they're going. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to tell you, all right, before I even tell you my sister, you tell me your sister. When you, how do you, when you, when you first, when you know you're about to go to one of these places that you say you wear this fragrance to, how do you get ready? Like, how do you, how do you spray it on? What's your sister? Well, what I do... I mix too. 
Oh yes, I have a, a lot of concoctions. I, yeah, you know, I mix. So cause even if but somebody, you can't tell that mix, you can't yeah, tell the mix. Nah, you can't never tell the mix. mix. So tell what mix. I do, so you know what I mean. Of course, like you say, you got to bathe. If you go somewhere, you got to wash your ass, and, and, then, and that's a. Uh, and if you a certain, if you a certain weight class like myself, fellas, if you bathe earlier that day. Get you another one in in the evening, <laughs> but you leave, but you leave the house. Yeah. So after you get that second shower in, that's when you know what I mean. You get out of the shower, you low. You know what I mean. Get your get your skin right. I can't tell them you know how you lotion and stuff. But then I spray the mix. I spray what I'm gonna wear, and then after I put the clothes on, that when I spray the initial. Get the wrist. Get the wrist. Get the air, get the air. And a lot of people don't know, I spray the top of my hair. You know, they make hair mix now. I don't even know, but the only reason I spray, I'm short. I so, mean. motherfucker who step, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Some girls be standing over yeah, a nigga, yeah, but yeah. they gonna smell like, who we smell good? Because they might be. Yeah. <laughs> that might be yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They make hair mix now. For, for, for all you short fellas out there, they make hair mix now. For real? So, I ain't even know that. They make hair mix. Yo, you, you definitely got to get you some hair mix now. So, um, all right. You say, I, I I'm not gonna tell you my spray system yet because it, it sounds like you kind of got yours down pat, you know. So um, I got a a, a, a segment here um, where I introduce three new fragrances that we don't have up here on the table. Uh -huh. And uh, you know how it is when you go around buying cologne; they always giving you shit to. Uh, you get you to come back and spend some more money. Yeah, and that come in handy. Yeah, it does. Cause uh, sometimes I just throw them in my bag. I know you. You taught me something the other day. I saw you put it online. You probably don't even remember. I don't. Wait, what? Man, about leaving uh, your cologne in the car. Oh yeah, that's a big no no in the summertime. No, yeah. No no, you do not leave your fragrance, especially for you people who like to buy that cheap shit that's just full of alcohol, the OD toilets. Please do not leave your fragrances in the car. The heat will weaken the notes and. You just got a bunch of scented alcohol and the longevity. <clears throat> wow, I got my shit out of that car so fast when so I saw you had it in there. So it's well, yeah, luckily, okay, you know what I mean? Yeah, no. Nah, I luckily, spray before I get out. Yeah, no, nah, no. Nah. So that's why when you get the when you go and get these uh, fragrances, you have to tell, hey, you know, before I open the box, let me get a couple samples so I can wear it on my skin. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? They gonna see, you already buying it, so they don't give a fuck. Yeah, like, yeah. Give you whole five of. And you just take them, in, yeah, yeah, you just take them and, and put them in your, your glove box or some shit like that, and then you know you good. You leave that in the crib and don't leave them in your bathroom either. For real? Taking hot showers. Oh, oh that steam. Well, nigga, where do you gotta put them? Bedroom. Leave them in your bedroom. <laughs> that nigga be high nigga on on the bed like a <laughs> gun. <laughs> God damn. Room temperature. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, look at the refrigerator. He got a row full of cologne. Cologne <laughs> everywhere. I got a mini fridge. <laughs> now, this is a um, fragrance birth from, it's called Liquid Imaginaries. Um, it's a new fragrance, and it's specifically sold in uh, Neiman's. Uh -huh. um, I haven't used it yet. It's something that they're trying to get me to buy. This is a segment called Situations. So, I am going to give you a situation, and you tell me which of these three fragrances you would pick to wear. All right. So you're going to spray them on them? Yeah. Right, so you. I'm going to give you the situation first, and then we're going to smell them, and then you tell me which one yeah. you think you would wear. All right. You are in Hollywood. Uh -huh. Red carpet, movie premiere. And the movie... Uh, Leading women. Uh, the women is a, is a lead women role. Okay. So, so majority of the cast is cast women. women. Yeah. You the only male. And you got the lead role. The lead male role. So you're going to be the okay. only male in Hollywood surrounded by all these women on the red carpet. Uh. Which fragrance would you pick? Shit. So, like I say, this is a Bello Rabello by... Liquid My uh, Imaginaries. Uh, this is a new one. I'm not hip to this one, but I will be trying it later on you know that's good shit they got they got a cap on this sample i ain't yeah, never I, had no shit like that and i've been buying cologne yeah that's that's not a top not hey and this, this women led movie is black women yeah oh, yeah because uh, <laughs> that make a difference yeah, too yeah for white women you yeah. can go and get a bottle of stencil from walmart they don't white women you can spray some of that shit from ross yeah they don't give a damn <laughs> oh hans what's that <laughs> they don't give a damn Okay. I mean, it gives me a... Uh, I'm going to see what you think. 
No, nah, that ain't it. That ain't it. You want to wear that one? All right, okay, cool. What What does that, like, Man, would you wear that one hell, at all? I wouldn't wear this shit nowhere. It, give, okay. it like incense. Okay, cool. Well, I'm glad, that's, I'm glad that's not one that I decided to bring in here today, that this is oh, the one. Oh, my bad, bro. So, so, no, so I see, I won't be going back to get that one, I guess. Man, this... Coffee beans. No, Folgers. She, she telling you to smell this. Oh. <laughs> Before we do the next scent. <laughs> oh, okay. I so, thought she smelled it, too. <laughs> That's why I say, oh, coffee beans. <laughs> Okay, gotcha. So this, they get the smell out. Yeah, oh, it, 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 it kind of reboots your palates. That don't nigga smart. Hey, you know, that's some shit I got. Man. Yeah, but that's... I, that's I, I put everybody on there. I don't think they even knew about that shit. Yeah, that's... Uh, a lot of people do that in other job professions. Yeah. When yeah. they smell stuff and they got to clear their nose when they try Well, you know, I've worked in both of those professions <laughs> yeah. where, you, where, you know what I'm saying, yeah. where, where we needed that. Yeah. So. <laughs> but that's neither here nor there. This is about the profession I'm in today. My bad. Um... The second one, bro, yeah. is uh. You don't mind me. Yeah, nah, yeah, hell nah. You, yeah. you, so you really disgusted yeah, with that one. Nah, I might. Yeah. Nah, so you said you wanted some cologne, did you? <laughs> <laughs> you said you wanted some, did you? Um, this is another brand, bro. I have, uh, this is a new one that they're trying to get me to start spending my money on. It's called Fanfare, and the scent is a mean. Okay. Um, again, I'm not hip to this one yet, but it's one that hopefully you approve of, because if it ain't, you know. I, I like the fact that, you know what I'm saying, you you finding out just like me. Oh, yeah. I ain't I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna come in here and try to put you on some shit that I already know about. It don't even look like they want us to smell this one. Oh, there you go. All right, man. Okay. I, I don't think you're gonna say the same shit about that one. I like this one. I like this one. Yeah. That that's up that's up for niggas that's, alley. Okay, 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 cool. Like it's it's smooth, like cool, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, and it's an evening type scene. Yeah, you know, that was, yeah. yeah. You put on a good button up or a polo. Oh, yeah. Your shirt needs some buttons in it. You don't put on no t shirt with that one. You need some buttons in your shirt. Nah, this smooth right here. Yeah, you need some buttons in it. Okay, so fan right now, fam, yeah, you got down with yeah, that. Yeah, you could yeah, just have that one standing up. <laughs> and uh okay. Yeah. Let me see which is the brand for this one, because I don't even know what the fuck this one is. Casa Marati is the brand. I, I like the name of that already. Yeah, because I know you like your Casamigo, so. Yeah. Yeah, so you can wear <laughs> this when you on. on uh, uh, yeah, uh, what I is, might. What, what's coming up? What's it? Cinco de Mayo. Oh, boy. Um, And it's the scent is called Mephisto. All right. Mephisto. Man. Mephisto. I don't know. Again, this is a new one. They just give me when I go in to buy fragrances. So don't hold me to it. Um, and This was fanfare. I like that. Yeah, fanfare. fanfare. Um, and to be honest, I think this is actually a branch of Surge Off. Okay. You just put me on another one. Surge Off, yeah. yeah. It is. Yeah, this, is a, this is actually... Surge Off made some good ones. Um, I have a bottle of Surge Off down here. We'll get to that in another episode. But, um, yeah, bro, let's let you smell this one. You tell me if... if is this a, a yay or nay? Would you would you pick this one? Or would you boot this hey, one like you booted the other one? Back to this, I see why they had the top on this shit. Because if if it's skip out that bottle. Ain't nobody gonna buy this <laughs> man, shit. Oh man. Okay. Search off got down without one. Now this tough. Yes. Between them two, between that's them tough, two. boy. That's Jesus. tough. I ain't gonna, boy. I ain't gonna hold you. Ooh. Yeah, that's Damn. hard for me because this one, this is this. Let me see that one again. Like both of them got that, like. But this one, I'm gonna tell you though, bro. This one is more of an evening, and this one is more of a a daytime. No, but no. I think the Colorado a little stronger though. It is, but the notes in this uh -huh. when they give off, this give off white t shirt, sun out. This give off button down, sun down. Hey, where you you remember when they was in the gas station uh, in the wood and they was talking about tic tacs oh, yeah. and yeah. Bremen? Like that's how Justin is when it comes to the. Cause I'm like I'm thinking I knew something. He was like now they get white t shirt. Now I see like so I gotta wear a white t shirt. Today. Oh yeah, it's like since bro, yeah. if if a, if you don't smell it and it it takes you somewhere with your whole outfit on and 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 where you are and what you doing. That ain't for you. So what? What I got right now? 
You got this one. The fanfare. Yeah. I think this was what I would wear on the red carpet. Fanfare. Because it's an evening. You told me it's an evening. <laughs> yeah. But I would wear it because it's like. Yeah, because I, I got. I'm trying to set. I'm trying to yeah, paint the picture like, for yeah. you. It's an evening. Because I can just. On the red walking. carpet. You know what I'm saying? You know, sometimes, bro, cologne make your outfit look better, too. Yeah, because you can have on a white t shirt and some. some Great joggers and this search off gonna do it. Yeah. This is a great daytime scent. I'm going to add this one to my collection. This that Cosmo Rider. Yes, I recommend this one for anybody who got a few dollars. Dang, and I ain't even oh. I ain't even reset my nose and I smelled that. Man, I'm telling you, this is it's off the chain. Yeah. Anybody who don't mind spending a few dollars on fragrances and you care about how you smell, this is definitely one that you may want to go and test. It don't work for everybody because I've smelled Fragrances in the store, got it home. It don't mix well with me. Uh, speaking of buying fragrances, do you buy? Can you buy them online? Are you one of those that can no, buy them online? No, no, no. I got to go in the store. Got, yeah, me I, too. Unless um, I already had one, right. and I'm, you know what I mean, That's the reading up on the ball. That's the only way. So it's like, um, just buy them yeah, just to do it. If it's something like Baccarat or something like that, and they got to sell online, you know how sex do. Yeah. Then be like, okay, yeah, I get that. I know which one I want with that. But as far as some colognes, I, I like to go in there and they be like, sell, sell that. Right. Yeah. So speaking of Baccarat, why are we on that? Do you, is that in your collection today? What you, how you feel about Baccarat since everybody just took over? Because you know, that used to be a status. Bro, yes. When it was just us. Hey, you well, know what I'm saying? Before, well, before PPP. That when, the, when the PPP dropped, unemployment, everybody got on it. Everybody got on it. You know what I'm saying? It was a, That was a, a, a bottle of status. Yeah. You know, back b before COVID, you know, if you had that red bottle with the gold top on it, mm -hmm. people, you spending four twenty five on cologne? Yeah, yeah, man, yeah. Now everybody got it. Everybody, I'm, got it. I'm gonna tell you what made me start wearing it, bro. I was in the gas station. Um, I ain't gonna even tell what hood I was in because I don't want no, I don't want no smoke. But I was in the gas station and um, I was about to grab me some cigar, but I realized let me go and grab me something to drink because I might get a little parched while I'm smoking. Yeah. So while I'm back there grabbing something to drink, another motherfucker walk in. Now, they grab something to drink, but they quicker than me and walk up to the counter. So I, I get a whip and I'm like, God damn, somebody got on that mock ride. Like, yeah, see yeah. what this is? Just, just because I know the type of fragrance it is. Bro, before I can get up to the fucking counter, I hear this motherfucker asking, do they have any loose single cigarettes in there? So I knew then, I do not want to smell like nobody that wants that, that, that yeah, buy a single loses. cigarette. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Asking how much a single fucking a cigarette costs. So I knew then. I, I, bro, I wanted to go wash that shit off my neck right then and there. So bro. I stopped wearing Baccarat. Because it was like a level of achievement. You know yes. what I mean? Because like, you don't just go out and buy. Bro, I'm going to keep it real. I ain't never think that I would be spending money on cologne never. like that. Cause like, why? You know what my go-to was? I didn't know was? what it is. You know what my go-to was, bro? What was it? I would go to Marshall's or Ross and they had some cologne called Chrome. Oh yeah. In the silver You're, water. Boy, the spray, blue light. That light blue, I spray that bitch down. And it lasts for about 30 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it lasts till you get to where you trying to go and you don't even smell the shit no more. And that's what that. got you keeping this good. Nishio, what, and what you, this about what, about 425? Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, about yeah. 425 bottle, you know, because I, I, like I say, I, 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 sh I shop around the places where you be grabbing that from. I got another scent. I'm but see, that but see, with, with that, it just, it show you something like that, that you don't, it be a, a levels with it. That, like, you know Very what I mean? So. Yeah, so Very it like, so. first it gets to the part like when you get a car. Like, okay. Nah, it's more than just driving. Right. You, I want the luxury inside the car. So it's like, that's how the like cologne is. Like that Mercedes Benz. Yeah, yeah like, something like that. Like yeah. when you finally get that Mercedes, you realize, okay, it's more it's, to it's, these Benz than just having exactly. this album. You got the AMG, you got the Fomatic, you got the, yeah. And get, but you know what? Um, when 2 Chains was on that song, uh, Good Drink, when he was like, Bond number nine, my favorite scent, right after that, I was like, I'm going to try Bond number nine. This around 2000. It was 2018. Mm -hmm. I got introduced to it like in 15. Oh, okay. 16. So then I get the bond number nine. I'm like, oh, yeah. I can afford it then, though. Yeah, bond number nine. Cool, cool. Then it just started going from there. Mm. But so I, that, that, that chrome that you used to wear back in the day. Oh, for so sure. you still have it in your collection? Hell no. Nah. You wouldn't dare hey, wear it again? 
I just like woodwear again. What type of compliments you used to get out of it? Like, what made you say chrome was your one? Like, how did you even find chrome? What made you settle for that one? Because I know what mine used to be before I started making money. Hey. I, I mean, before I start thinking I'll make money, I ain't making none yet. I ain't. Hey, when I think about it now, it'll be like, oh... My mama friends and auntie. Nephew, what you got on? Yeah, and they and you probably had just sprayed it. Yeah. Because yeah. it don't last. Because the thing that, about it, I ain't really go winning stores and people chrome, like, what yeah. you got on? Chrome is a uh, OD toilet, and that is the bottom. Bro, you um, couldn't tell me nothing with that chrome, though. That's Why? back when they Why? had Yeah, man, I used that chrome, curve, Lucky 7, Mamba. And guess what, though? At Ross and Marshall, they keep the shit locked up. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. Like, yeah. if you, Man, if you, you don't sit this shit up here. You can give this shit away. I don't even know why they have it locked up. But, but they lock up the boxes, too, so. Yeah. 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 Like, the Tommy boxes, the Lacoste boxes, you can't even get a pair of They, off they ain't got you. the elastic in the damn waistband at, at Ross, so shit. They don't need to lock these motherfuckers up. They ain't gonna even stay on my ass. <laughs> But no, nah, bro. Um, seriously, that 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 uh, baccarat. That is something that I just I love to death. Uh-huh. It's one of my favorites. It's still in my collection, but I, I won't wear it unless I mix it. it. It's, but you know, you know the thing about baccarat. It's unisex. Yeah, a lot of my fragrances. Are yeah, unisex. so it's like, bro. Me and my baby mama, we got a beef in one time about it. Cause like oh, I'm God, looking, man. I'm like, bro, you spraying too much. Yeah, come on, man. But see, we all sharing the bottle. It's, it's cool. Bro. No, we wasn't sharing. Oh, it was yours. It was mine. Oh shit, yeah, okay. Like, yeah, what the yeah, hell yeah, you yeah. doing? You doing too much, baby? Uh, do you do you are you the one that get the lotion and the um like the the body oils to go with these fragrances? Cause you know, like baccarat, a lot of these um. Fragrances come with the lotion and the body oil, and it helps when you wear it. Yeah, so like, um, I um like body lotion and um the soap. It's some Balmain. I like the Balmain Rich lotion. Nigga shit, I ain't quite made it there yet. But no, but man, if I take. Look, I'm gonna keep it so real on this motherfucker. I show. appreciate the hell out of that. I'm gonna light my blood up while you keeping it real. <laughs> so look, shit. I'm out, I'm out there in LA. I'm at this hotel. So you know that how they have the hand soap and the lotions. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, uh, I'm getting lotion. And I, you know how you have your little carry on. So I dump all my Dove soap out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I fill my bottle up with the Balmain. I was like, boy, this shit too good. I got to take, you got to take me some of this with me. So I'm like, I want some of the lotion too. Let me, ask them, let me ask them like if they got some of the what's the name. So I called the desk, because it's good at a hotel now. I Obviously, they desk. got Balmain yeah. lotion in So the I called the hotel, I mean, called the front desk. I was like, can I get some uh, get some of the body lotion, uh, the personal? They were like, uh, housekeeping will be over there in a second. He come, he got the big bottle uh, of body lotion. What, like, he just refilling? No, he, he, I said, uh, it's the, I said, what I supposed to do? He was like, oh, just leave it in the room. <laughs> he, he said, oh, it's yours. I said, I'm finna, you know, like, I'm going out to venture. Right. So I needed just person he was like it's yours, whatever you do with it. Boy, I wasn't even gonna check a bag. <laughs> oh, that bag getting checked. It get checked. That lotion coming with me. I'm gonna pay thirty dollars to check oh, a bag. Oh man. Then two hundred dollars for this lotion. Jay Whitehead, nigga, suitcase full of lotion, body wash, shampoo, conditioner. I got every bottle they had there. Man, I don't blame you. You are supposed to do that. When we get off, when we get through film, you tell me that hotel. I will tell you the hotel because I'm, I'm going, going back. I'm going, we, we we both in LA. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Hey man, go get you some know lotion. You got to. I got to, because I promise you, I'm taking some empty uh, vials with me or uh, uh, whatever. So I, I got to, yeah. I got to. Well, I fe- man, I felt so damn roguish sitting there with that. Because uh, you know you had your little personal dub bottle. Yeah. I think I got it right under the suspense. And I'm going to tell you just how, how far I'm going to go with it. I'm going to get me some hot water and rinse all the dub out the fucking bottle before I put the ball main in it. I want to make sure it ain't nothing but it's that. I want that ball main to be uncut. Bruh. I don't want oh, that no. Man, if I would show you, bro, because I had, because a couple of them, I had some, uh, the little Dr. Bronas. Oh, yeah. That I ain't pull, cheap either, no. no I, pulled, I pulled that shit out. Got rid of it. Got rid of it. I, it ain't cheap, but it ain't more than this ball main. I'm telling you. So, I'm going to back it up a little bit. You say your, your, your baby mama was using up all your Baccarat. Mm. So, did that make you want to go buy her a bottle? No, she, but see, this is the thing. She, um, at first, this one, because she was like certain perfumes, she was like, uh, 
mess up her allergies and stuff mm. like that. So she was testing it with you. No, but look, I noticed one because once I start buying like certain like colognes and scent, you know what I mean. I see some there spray. I was like, I try some shit with her. I forget the name of that pink bottle. Pink bottle. It's a pink bottle of perfume. Uh, it'd be right there by the uh Clyde. Pink bottle. Oh, uh, you got me on that one. Damn. So much right over in the uh, in sex or Neiman's? It's in sex. Okay. A lot of women was on it. I kind of, oh man, I want to look it up. But anyway, but I know the certain, certain perfume. To the left or the right? Because you know. It's to the right. It, it is be, it over there with all the other shit? Nah, or it be, it's in a little when, section by itself? When you walk in there, it's right there by the, uh, by the Clyde. Uh, it's, um, damn. I, you got me stuck. Cause I know, I, I'm in there all the time, so I mean, but yeah, we'll get to it. But I just, the reason I was asking you that, when you buy a gift for a person, when you buying fragrance as a gift for a person, how do you judge what you get for them? What you mean? Like, how do you determine like this is what you're buying for that person? Like, let's say if you want to, if you did want to go buy her a bottle, or you want to buy your brother a bottle, your dad a bottle for Father's Day, how do you determine what you buy for them? See, that that's why I'm not at with it. You ain't so you just Yeah, I just it ain't like it, like this how they should smell type jump. So you will go and get what you like and hope they like it. Yeah, for sure. Okay, cool. Uh so, the brand is Perfumes de Marley. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah, with yeah. that when when she got that, she was cool, but she, like she see me mixing. Now she want to be. She, hey, bro, don't. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But it was to the point, like, my mom, I could get my mom some Joe Malone. And yeah, she be cool Joe with Malone, that. Yeah. yeah. Joe and Malone that's, is cool. Yeah, it's cool. I like, got it got this different Joe sense and frame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so it's like, my mom do some cool light. with that. Yeah, it's light but, and, and it's, it's, it's a great uh, mix. Yeah, my dad don't be giving a damn. Yeah. That nigga spray You can go get him some chrome. Man, he'll spray anything, though. My dad won't what I will. Yeah, and he was oh, wearing, he was wearing juke before I started making money. Now he got damn. He want that. He want yeah. My dad spray some Tom shit. Ford on here. Lose it, goddamn money. <laughs> so, um, all right, uh, I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna rate your ball and then we're gonna get on the one that I got for today. Which okay, is my bet. personal favorites. Um, personally, and I ain't just saying it because you my homeboy. So you said because you my brother. You you pick. This is a good goddamn. Favorite. Oh, for this sure. is definitely one I would add to my to my um collection. Um it it's that grown man. It, yeah, that, yeah, yeah. It, it, it smells like you making some money and you got business about yourself. Bro, I'm gonna say this. It like it's sweet but it ain't. No, this is it's definitely bro. It's that grown man he makes some money. Um you know he know what he's doing. He he got style. That's what this is and but it's it's also that that summertime. I don't, I wouldn't wear this when I gotta put a jacket on. That's mm. that's what I want to. I'm gonna base my. I'm gonna layer my arms and, and my neck gotcha. and shit with that. I ain't covering nothing. So tell me this, just this is just me asking you. Go how ahead. many times do you spray cologne? Like you don't till I hit my finger pop. You spray that much, nigga? I want you to know I I've been there. When I walk out of this bitch, I want you to say, Justin was in there. Hell yeah. <laughs> See, when bro, I walk down that hall, I want you to say, Rambo been through here? Hell yeah. You got, see, I still be cheap with this shit. Oh, no, uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> bro, we making too much goddamn money. And hey, you I, make more than me. No, I don't. You're damn lying. I spray my damn... I, 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 we, we talk off of this. I see, know you. bro. See, you got damn... If you gonna bullshit me, we can go and get another guest in here. Yeah. I really... I sp- look, I spray the... I told you I spray it. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. don't do like this, do you? Oh, no, you don't please, rub. You don't. No, 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 no you don't please, rub. Please don't do that. I spray that immediately out of the shower though. But I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna oh. tell you a cheat code. I'm gonna tell you a cheat code, bro. If you can get the body spray and the lotion that matches that scent, do that. Because when you first get out of the shower, that's when your pores are open. And, I, mm-hmm. and, 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 and you know, I'm hoping you take hot showers. And you ain't know, taking cold showers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Your pores are open. So that's when you know what I'm saying. I'm taking a cold yourself. shower. Some shit ain't some right shit ain't around right. that motherfucker. You block yourself where you're going to spray it with that towel. Make sure your pores stay open. Then you hit it with the body oil if you got the body oil. If you ain't got no body oil, you go ahead and hit it with the with the cologne. Mm. So that way it gets in your pores. And the warmer you get and the more you moving around, the more active you are, it's seeping out. 
You got this nigga be a professor hey, about man, this I'm shit, telling, man. Look, this is what I do. When you're ugly as I am, you better smell good. And then I, I spray mine. I, I, I spray the creases off mine. And with no wearing shorts, I spray behind my legs. So you you might spray that one for about 20 times. I, about 14. I ain't going to tell you no lie. Well, that's a lot of spraying. I know. I know. Dog. Seven when I get out of the shower and seven more when I put my clothes on. That's why they love me at that comedy. When they see me coming, I, I, I bet they, 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 they be like the dope man. They know he's mine. He mine. You better. You know. Hey, they know they got to sell when you walk when in. When I walk in, they be scared. You know, they be over there socializing and, and conversing amongst what? each other. But I walk you in. You just spraying motherfucker. Bro. Rashad worse than me. Bro. Bro. You know I was staying with Rashad. Yeah. He'll come over there and want to spray some of my colognes and shit when he ran out. Nigga, oh, I be, man, nah, if I, I wasn't living with him, bro, I would swung on his ass a couple times. Can't nobody else spray my shit bro. more than me. No. <laughs> Sean don't give a goddamn. He, he'll think it's a tester ball. I'm, I think I seen Sean lift his fucking arm up one time spraying my shit. I mean, you don't give my motherfucking fragrance, man. <laughs> shit. I'm talking about he sprays it. Yeah. So, before I go back down that rabbit hole and piss myself off thinking about how much this nigga sprayed my cologne. I have one today that I want to introduce you and everybody else on. I don't I don't know if I'm introducing you to it because you shop where I shop it. Yeah, I ain't no, I ain't never heard of YSL. Okay, well, this is one of YSL's latest um fragrances for men. It's called Myself. Uh-huh. And um <laughs> I bought it for myself. So I'm trying to see if you might like this motherfucker for yourself. Oh, you ain't used it yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've, oh. I've sprayed it once or twice, but you haven't. So we're gonna see what you think about I it. Bet. Yeah, you can um you can find this in Macy's, Sephora, or anywhere they sell fine fragrances. All right, bet. This is one of my favorites. I ain't gonna tell you no lie. It immediately went up to. Oh no. Nah. Oh yes. Yeah. And it can be used as a, you can replace for your everyday. You ain't gotta wear it. Yeah. You know what I said? I'm gonna tell you why. I'm, and this is the good part about it. This bottle right here, a hundred dollars. It's a good mixer too. Yeah, you can mix it, but you don't really have to because mm -hmm. this is one of the ones that's gonna be kind of. It's going to take a couple of times for you to see what you can mix it with. It got to be very yeah, light. Yeah. Uh -huh. My go-to to mix this with, the only two that I know for sure is uh, made by Francis Curtis, and that's going to be that Baccarat or the Amaris. Uh, Those are the... That Amaris is a good one Man, let me tell you something. You can... Ooh. What? And it's a... This nah, is this, a good... Yeah. This a $100? This bottle is $100. This is the cheapest bottle. You know, I got it for traveling. You know, we always on the road. But no, that's... Boy, that's one of them ones. So what you give it on scale of 1 to 10? Cause I give it a, cause the longevity for this one is a, the, a minimum of six hours, and it, it. When I smell it, it has more of uh, me smelling it right now. The patchouli it notes I get, woodsy notes. Um, it, it, it's make got like orange blossom in it. Um, Just off the smell, the price, all that factoring into it, I get an eight and a half. Yeah, definitely. Like I would wear this like on some. Just anytime, yeah. it's an anytime scent. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Anytime of the day scent, but it's more of a spring summer scent. How you was talking about like evening type of stuff? I wouldn't be even putting no time. That, yeah, on, yeah, that's, no that's why I say it's any time of the yeah. day scent. This is just any time of the day, whether you're going out for the morning, too, yeah. whether you just getting out for the evening, or you stepping out late at night, like like we do. We go, we work at night, so well we working now, but we work all day. So this is a great fragrance for people like us who just work all day or you want to just smell good all day. I don't give a damn what you do. This is uh -huh. a great one. Um, and like I said, you can get it at Sephora. You can get it at Macy's, Neiman, Saks. Anywhere Bro, they sell I feel like fragrance. that's a hidden gem. It really is. Yeah. Because, you know, people are stuck on the YSL Y. And that mm -hmm. was a good fragrance. Yeah. That, that's one that I was, I was wearing back in 17 also that people start to get you know, attached to, now it's overpopulated, and it, it's just like that's a barge, and I can't, I don't want to wear it because you can go anywhere and yeah, slide it, you know what I'm saying? They want to know why. Oh yeah, definitely. So you, you keep that, let me, I'm going to write it down for you, so you, yeah. you, you. Now I ain't going to forget why I sell myself. Oh, yeah, cool, well yeah, you keep that, you make sure you. I got to remember look. this. So you know not to get that I know book. not to ever get this shit. <laughs> Bello, so Bello you, Rebello. Yeah, so you make sure. Now if I was in that move and it was white women, I'd wear this shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're probably like, oh, wow. Hell yeah. yeah. I need to know the price of this, though. I don't know. I hope it's free. Yeah. It's crazy. But you know what? It's going to be one that still costs a lot of money. Yeah. And it's hey, going to be people go get it just because it costs Bro, money. and then some spray one was on. So now we done been spraying a lot of stuff, so you we can see. You're doing it to yourself. 
No, I'm thinking, what if they have different, you know what I mean? Sense No, nah, this shit, it'll still smell like something I kill ants with. Oh, man, this shit horrible, no. dog. This shit smell like somebody the Avon book, right? No. <laughs> if it was, if it was mosquito repellent or Nigga, like you said Avon, yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah, like if it was mosquito repellent or some witch hazel, it'll be good. They but, probably think we like pass this over there to them. Hey, man. look, no, they, you can smell this shit through the the camera. This is, I'm <laughs> telling you, this is something that I would buy somebody who hey. I don't care for, but I have to buy a gift. Hey, buy somebody that you really don't fuck with. That yeah, shit. and you know what I'm saying? Like, Damn, I put no. a secret sound, and I'm like, man, I don't fuck with this nigga. Right. Damn, bro, what I do to you? <laughs> right. Yeah, nigga, nigga know I'm real. Yeah. Damn, I don't bro. This shit. So we beefing? Nah, yeah. why you say that? Nigga, I smelled this shit you bought. Because this shit smell like Edgewood and car smoke. So, <laughs> you know, we're going to scrap that one out of the way. This is not one that Nav nor I would suggest anybody go and get. Right. No disrespect Damn, to that brand what? because they have several more that we're going to be trying throughout the season. But I have... Yeah, you can't like them all. Yeah, you can't like them all. Yeah, you can't like them all. Um, I have enjoyed myself in here getting to know my brother uh, sent uh, that he used to wear back in the day, that chrome and what he wear today, and I and I'm and I'm glad I've been rubbing off on him because I, I see now that you know when he yeah, go yeah. in the store and buy shit like this, he been around me a little yeah, too hey, long. Not I, too long because you know it's never too long, but he been around me enough to know it just, what a fragrance is. You put me up on game today. I ain't spraying enough. Oh yeah, no, a no, nigga no. ain't gonna outspray you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. no, I'm telling you, no, you ain't spraying enough, bro. You ain't spraying enough. Just, you know, you, you spray enough for... So you doing all the colognes like that 14 minimum? Yeah, I wouldn't give a damn what it is. Sometimes, I, that might, I might spray more. I don't know. I just know. To say to my finger pop? Nigga. <laughs> you like them young niggas who going around shooting and killing? Nigga, I'm telling you. I, I, nigga, I, to the goddamn clip empty. <laughs> goddamn right. <laughs> But no, man, bro, I appreciate you for coming through. Man, for sure, I had saying. to, man. Congratulations on your show, Thank first you, of all, bro. man. Appreciate I'm glad that. you uh had me as one of your guests, man. Man, dog, you know I ain't finna do shit and don't have my dog. Yeah. Really. Season two, you gotta you gotta have some guy like give back. Like you make enough money where you could buy a nigga a cologne. Well, well, you, okay. Well, you know I, what I do is season two, I just start saving up all these motherfuckers and put. Man, you got me fucked up. <laughs> Season three, the budget, you know what I'm saying? You know, when we start getting that bread, I can start going to get a little ball of chrome for motherfuckers. Oh, shit. Like that, and rock. that has been my episode of My Cinnamon for today. Now, Green, our guest, appreciate y'all. Man, appreciate you, Thank man. You.